Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to a short film review of the new Arrow video release of Basket Case on 4K. Now we picked this up um, a couple of days ago, me and the lad on 4K because he doesn't have it. Um, I have the um, uh, the Blu-ray on Second Sight box set so I have not picked it up for myself but we picked it up for the lad and, and he watched it for the, uh, for the very first time and um he really enjoyed it i mean uh i, I love the film anyway it's fantastic and uh, uh it's a great fun sort of real cult sort of horror film you know real sort of strong cult following so it was good to get to picking up um the story sort of follows uh, a young lad who has like a, a sort of twin that's attached to him when he was born and it's just like a small of a monstrosity attached to his body and these surgeons remove it and the and they both survive um and the sort of monster lives in the basket and our our hero carries it around with him um and they kind of were seeking out revenge on these surgeons for um splitting them apart because i don't think neither of them wanted it um so it's like a revenge movie and they both have this sense where they can sort of pick up on each other what they're both sort of feeling and so we get through quite a few uh, moments when um, our main character is picking up when the monster is doing something bad and when the, our main character gets in a relationship with a young female our monster feels it and gets jealous and starts going on a bit of a rampage to sort of uh, revenge this sort of feeling that he's got uh, eventually they catch up with the surgeons and uh, they, they sub, the, the surgeons and doctors come to their sort of end and then it's like um, it's a free for all at the end and our poor sort of hero and his uh, um, monster gets sort of found out but it's a wonderful film it's got loads and loads of wonderful characters in the film because um, he, he moves into this like this block of rented flats in, in New York it's all based in like 19 sort of 80s 70s grimy sort of New York um, very similar to like Maniac and things like that so it's it, it's it's got that sort of feel about it and that sort of um, really sort of run down sort of sleazy feel to the film but which is fantastic really enjoy that um and it's got a great ending now this version by arrow it, it's really really cool the blu-ray i mean we he, he got the 4k looks absolutely pristine i mean i have the second sight ones and it's full of um noise and it's full of sort of like uh um all sorts of a uh, uh sort of uh what's the word i'm looking for um it's got lots of grain in in my version of the film. Here's what I've got, hardly got any any. It almost looks like a sort of like new film. But it's really, really cool. And they've done a really good job on it. Uh, the sound's a little bit iffy, though. The sound's up and down, up and down. Um, where I prefer the original sort of mono uh, kind of sound. Um, this it tries to incorporate that. But it, it's lost its sound a little bit, I thought, on the... On the, on the uh, on the 4k we found ourselves some parts it was too loud in other parts it was too quiet but it was still really really cool uh, and it was great to watch it and it was great to see my lad see it for the first time um, I do recommend you getting the film if you've never seen it it is an absolute cult classic um, like um, sort of um, Street Trash um, Toxic Avenger um, Brain Damage and that it's that sort of kind of sort of um, black humour horror film with some good gore um some silly uh clay um sort of puppet effects of the creature which is still pretty really really cool although it looks really weird and dated and silly it still plays out really well and adds charm to the film which is really really cool it, it is a great film though i love the film i've seen it i don't know how many times I, i've seen it way back in the day you know back on the vhs days and i'm still watching it today you know 20 30 years 40 years later i'm still watching the film and it's still a good watch so i do recommend it if you get a chance 
anyway that's my little review of the new release from the arrow video i do recommend the 4k version it looks amazing i've got no comment on their blu-ray release of it because i don't have it um so like i said i've got the second sight trilogy box set so i don't feel the need to rebuy the film um but we picked it up for the lad because he hasn't got it and we had a great time watching it so if you get a chance to pick it up it wasn't too expensive it was about 20 odd pounds so it was not too bad on 4k um, if you get a chance to pick it up, I would say pick it up. Cheers, guys.